So industrial design program at Metro, uh, we try to be um, a local industry serving uh, institution. We start to offer textile class so students can learn how to sew, how to build, and when they graduate, they can use that skill right away. One of the reasons why I chose Metro State University is because honestly, they have a more technical background. It's not just drawing or not just the art side of industrial design, but it's how things work, how things are built. The program at MSU Denver, the faculty really helps us learn how to think creatively to problem solve and come up with solutions. While I was doing research for uh, the industrial design programs, it was one of the only programs that had such an intensive hands-on program. And that's what I love so much. I think it's great that you can think of so many ideas, but actually being able to make that product is something that's invaluable. We are the only accredited program in the state of Colorado. For a student coming in, they can come in confidently knowing that we have state-of-the-art equipment, experienced teachers. Those things add up to the overall quality of education. I was at CU Boulder for mechanical engineering and Santa Clara University for mechanical engineering as well. A lot of my instructors didn't necessarily understand the hands-on aspect of what they were really teaching. So when I came to Metro, I was really impressed to learn that a lot of the instructors here are either running their own company or still very much involved in the design world. And I think that definitely adds to the educational experience here. Some of the vital skills that I will walk away with from MSU would be really communication. Because no matter how great your idea, no matter how wonderful and how many people it can save or how much money it can bring in, if you cannot communicate that idea, it's just all mute. The industrial design department has done a lot of community engagement projects with smaller companies, independent inventors, or some larger companies as well. The important thing is that it brings a real world perspective into the classroom. I've learned how to use the ShopBot and the ShopBot program and the machinery. A lot of times for our studio classes, we have outside clients come in and ask us for different products. And because I know how to use these machines and use these programs, I'm able to produce solutions for them. Developing a product from the ground up and actually launching it out to the industry is really a, really a cool feeling. I was in New York and ended up seeing a fixture that I had designed in one of these stores, and that was a phenomenal experience. The way that I got into this job is I started off as an intern because of the, the requirement for graduation in the Metro program, and then moved throughout four different brands in their engineering side. Um, and without the technical abilities, essentially, that, that Metro taught me, would have never been able to do those jobs initially. We were delighted to find that uh, Metro State University of Denver has a program where they're training engineers to do exactly the kind of work that we do here and have hired students from that program. Our industrial design program here at Metro State is uh, certainly well-rounded. We have a bicycle design class. The students really like soft goods for active things like uh, backpacking, the textiles industry. And that's the kind of thing we're focusing on. As an industrial designer, the more you can build, the better, the better it is. The more hands-on experience, the better it is.